it's your boy Parpar Par here coming at you guys with another brand new Animal Jam video and today in Animal Jam guys we are going to be going over the brand new July 4th themed update that has brought so many freedomy things out into the land of Jamal like these red white and blue stars right here this freedom banner that looks like an American flag and then this banner that goes all the way across Jamal Township and then there's even some freedom fireworks outside of the diamond shop which are really amazing because if you click on them they shoot off fireworks obviously because that's what fireworks do but now before we get into going over this update I have to announce today's daily giveaway which is this big package of five spike Roonies and if you want a chance to be the lucky winner of all five of these spikes then all you have to do is one leave a like on this video and that's really simple and free just punch that like button right in the face and then two be subscribed to my channel by clicking that red subscribe button right below this video and finally leave a comment in the comment section down below letting me know why you think you're worthy of winning all five of these spiked wristbands and I'm going to be going through the comments later on tonight and picking a random person to win all five of those spikes so I wish all of you guys luck on being that random person that wins but now let's get right into the update and on the first page here Animal Jam finally announces another thing where they give us a thousand of and this time it's a thousand pets so it says ajhq is super grateful for the millions of jammers all over the world who play animal jam and without each and every one of you jamal wouldn't be the fun and exciting world that it is so as a way of saying thank you no i don't want your trade so as a way of saying thank you now all jammers can adopt oh my god no i don't want your trades i have to take all this stuff off my trade list so i can stop getting traded while i'm going through this update but anyways it says so as a way of saying thank you now all jammers can adopt up to a thousand different pets wait what this feature is for non-members as well that's crazy so i guess now all the non-members out there can't complain that animal jam never gives them any of the cool 1000 thing features because look at that AJ just gave everybody everybody that plays Animal Jam members and non-members 1000 pet spaces that you can now use to make as many pets as you want and I guarantee nobody is ever going to fill up all 1000 of those pet spaces so that's really exciting and by the way I really love the art that's on the front page right here like this looks like a big nice family photo that Animal Jam put together and I really like it and then there's also the Animal Jam signature ladybug in the top right that you can get from those AJ igloos if you redeem enough codes so that is cool and then on the next thing it talks about Grilly Sideout, which is one of Animal Jam's old, old, old diamond shop dens. So I'm not completely sure why they're talking about it here, but let's go ahead and read this and find out why. And it says, are you enigmatic? And I don't even know what enigmatic means. So I might be, I might not be. And then it says, do you like to spend time in the shadows? If so, Grilly's Hideout is perfect for you. Pick up this awesome den today and know what it's like to live like the mysterious wolf alpha who we all know as Grilly. And that seems really cool. So I guess if I don't have this den or if I do already have this den, I'll buy it and then decorate it. And then Extravaganza was the next thing in this Jamal journal which is really awesome and kind of weird to be honest because I thought that this promo was going to disappear after Easter since it has to do with eggs and everything like that but it's actually stuck around and Animal Jam keeps releasing new kind of pets through these eggs and I guess now there is another new pet that has came to Jamal so let's go ahead and buy a few eggs I guess to see if we can get this new mystery pet and it would be awesome if Animal Jam made dinosaurs a pet because imagine walking around with a dinosaur behind you or something crazy of that nature but let's go ahead and randomize this egg and buy it in hopes that we are getting the new pet that has came to AJ so let's buy it for three diamonds and please I beg that this pet is the new pet that came to AJ so I can show it to all of you guys in a video in a few days or something like that so I recommend to you guys out there if you're watching right now and you haven't already gotten an egg to get an egg to see if you can get the new pet that has came to AJ but then on this next page Animal Jam is talking about something called Call of the Alphas and once again the picture on this page looks like a big family photo that Animal Jam put together so that's pretty funky and then let's go ahead and read it so it says hidden throughout this new party are items that alphas use in their fight to protect your mom. So whenever you see an item, click on it to learn more about it and fill up your journey book page. And if you find all 12, you'll earn a special prize. So be sure to keep your eyes on the party list and join the next call of the alphas. Whoa, dude. So it looks like Animal Jam just released a party just like the paradise party where you click on birds and find out what kind of birds they are. Except this time you have to do it with alphas on this party right here. And you get to find out what kind of items or things that the alphas use to fight against the phantoms with. So that's pretty sick. And I guess I'll probably make a whole entire video about that while I do that adventure. And then on the next page, you have your normal travel traveling animals and returning animals, blah, blah, blah. Arctic foxes will be traveling soon, so make sure you pick up an Arctic fox before they're gone. And then also pandas are coming back, which are one of my favorite animals, so I guess I can be excited for this. And then Sketch Jam is up next where they show you how to make a coyote in the Masterpiece feature, I guess. So that's amazing. I guess I will now watch that and learn how to make a coyote. And then apparently AJHQ also brought out some new Masterpiece frames, which are awesome because I'm always looking for new frames to put my art in. And this one right here looks really Summer Carnival-ish like, so I might make a summer carnival themed masterpiece or something like that. And then finally, Animal Jam has an advertisement talking about the two new Animal Jam books, which I got at VidCon called The Call of the Alphas and The Phantom Secret. And by the way, guys, there's a new promo code that you can redeem called Heartstone that will actually give you The Call of the Alphas book in the game. And I already redeemed it, so it's not going to work for me. But if you guys type in and redeem the code Heartstone, you'll now get this Call of the Alphas book, which I think you can put in your den and read. And I don't know if you can. So let's actually go to my den right now and see if that works. Okay, so here it is. So let's click on it and put it in the den now. 
now and then if we click on it again oh that's cool it says do you want to join the call of the alphas and does this take me to the call of the alphas adventure or party hold on oh that's actually so sick so i don't even have to wait for the party that just came out and it brought me straight to the call of the alphas party without having to wait so that is actually so cool and so i guess i can now look for the different things that the alphas use to fight the phantoms so let's do this guys all right guys so i just came up on this kind of spooky looking place and i found this conveyor belt that looks like something graham would make so i'm guessing that something from the journey book will be coming along this way very soon so i'm just gonna wait here and see if anything comes out hey and there we go i just got graham's goggles that is so cool and it says graham the monkey alpha is always creating and inventing his goggles to help him search his workshop to find the right gizmo doodad or thingamajig he needs so that is awesome i just got the first thing of this new journey book page and now i really want to find the rest of the things in this journey book to get the gift but i feel like it would take way too long because it took me five minutes just to find this place right here but i guess i'll go searching for at least a little bit more till i find one more thing whoa look at this place that i'm entering now guys it's very rocky and it doesn't look like the land that i was just at at all so maybe there's like a grilly item up here or something i'm sensing and there we go i just got another item but it wasn't something to do with grilly it's cosmos seed bag and it says containing seeds from almost every plant imaginable cosmos seed bag is used by the knowledgeable koala alpha as he replenishes the flora of jama nice this is actually such a fun adventure guys i love this or it's not an adventure i shouldn't be saying that it's a party so if you guys want to come to the party i guess come to my den and click on the call of the alphas book or just redeem the code yourself which is called heartstone which will give you the call of the alphas book and it'll take you right to the call of the alphas party where you can find all of the things that the alphas use and what the heck is this whoa i just got cosmo's hat sweet it says cosmo the koala alpha spends much of his time in forests and meadows talking with his plant friends and his hat keeps him cool even on the sunniest of days and that's pretty weird i'm not gonna lie that he talks to plants like he actually has conversations with plants i think he might be a little bit crazy but we're gonna add this to the journey book anyways and this is actually so much fun i really want to find all the other things in this journey book like i'm not even kidding this is addicting and these people are actually helping me out this person just said pex earring is here but i don't see where it is and they just said when the carrots pop up so apparently i have to wait for one of these carrots to pop up that is so cool and there it is guys the carrots just popped up so i'm clicking around aimlessly hopefully i can find something and yes i got it there we go it's called pex earring and it says peck the bunny alpha loves every type of music and the bell on her earring jingles out amazing melodies whenever she moves walks and dances and this is so weird because i'm pretty sure peck's earring was also found in a secret place in one of the adventures so i don't know if there's like something special behind these earrings but that's pretty sick that i just found another one and there we go i just got liza's camera with big thanks to video gamer boy forever for leading me to it and it says liza the panda alpha is passionate about photography and she carries her camera with her wherever she goes and helps of snapping the perfect shot that sounds a lot like wisteria moon so now i have about half of these items and i think i'm gonna try and get all of the rest of them in this video too just because why not dude i really want to see what this gift is in the call of the office journey book so let's go and find all of these other items too boom there we go i just got another one it's called grilly's cloak and it says grilly the wolf alpha uses his cloak to help him blend into the darkness whenever he needs to observe the dark phantoms from the shadows and there we go now i need like five more items and then i should be good so hopefully my boy video gamer boy forever can lead me to the next ones then i just got peck's paintbrush and it says the creative bunny alpha is always looking to add beauty to the world and peck's paintbrush can help turn even the most mundane objects into works of art then i just got sir gilbert's map that's nice because that's the first sir gilbert item i got and it says they say that knowledge is power and sir gilbert's map helps the regal tiger alpha keep track of the dark phantoms movements throughout jamal and now i got liza's compass and apparently now this is where Gurley's journal is so that's the second last item that i need and i got this mysterious little item but now the last item i need is supposedly in this blue tent right here so once i get that i should be good and i should be able to unlock the gift in the journey book so let's wait for sir gilbert's cape now mm. Him. And I should be able to unlock the gift in the journey book, so I'm just gonna wait for Sir Gilbert's cape now. And I got it, yes! So it's called Sir Gilbert's Armor, and now it is time to open up the gift and see what it is, so I'm gonna close my eyes like I usually do, and open them in 3, 2, 1, and it's an alpha archway! Oh my god, that is so cool! Like, seriously, that is so cool, and I think I can put this in pretty much any of my alpha dens that I have. So there you go, that is the prize that you get for completing your Call of the Phantoms journey book page, and I hope this somewhat helped you guys out. But with that being said, now I think that's pretty much gonna wrap it up for this update video. So thank you guys so much for watching and as always don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button right in the face and i'll see you guys in my next video peace out